All right, OBS just kind of exploded there. Sorry about that. Let me get my fan in a decent position. I'm sweating already. Gotta get my microphone as close as I can. Sorry about this. Sorry about the rumble. The rumble feature. All right, so last time we accidentally skipped rock bottom, so let's go do that. Let's go do rock bottom. I have this move now. That's fun. I accidentally hit Patrick with it. Wow, SpongeBob, you found some. Now they're back. Home, safe where they belong. Here's your golden back scratcher. Spatula. I don't speak Italian. <laughs> wow, Spud. Now they're back. Here's your all right, I think that's all we can get right now. Might want to turn the volume down on my end. Cause I don't, I don't want it too loud because it kind of makes it hard to talk. And you don't want that. Oh, oh, oh. I notice I tend to be a bit more silent during this game than I do uh, some of the others I stream. But I mean, really, when the game says stuff like, you know, retirement home girls gone wild, how are you going to compete with that? What are you supposed to say when that happens? Anyway, I guess rock bottom is the next stop. You are now in leaving Bikini Bottom. Okay, that was a mistake, but I, I wanted to try it. I mean... It's probable that I could go on to the next area right now, but where's the fun in that? Again, be sure to tell me if my fan here is causing too much of like a warbling noise, but... Welcome to the dark depths of Rock Bottom, home of strange creatures and souvenir t-shirts. Well then I'll have to pick up a couple of those on my way out. Such sheer wanton violence. Oh, SpongeBob, I'm actually glad you're here. And believe it or not. I'm glad I'm here too, Mrs. Puff. The robots have stolen priceless artwork from the museum. If you can return it all to me, I'll reward you with a golden spatula. Why do you want all that artwork? Don't ask questions you aren't prepared to handle the answer to. Consider the artwork saved, Mrs. Puff. <laughs> uh, Mrs. Puff is in rare form in this game. Let me tell you that. All right, so basically you gotta, well, technically speaking, I think you can just do this. Yeah. Oh uh, yeah, see like, like that, that line, how am I supposed to top that? Like when the game says something like that, how am I supposed to deal with that? I don't think I can make it over there. 
trying to sequence break, but it's probably not a good idea. Can't actually go in there. Can I jump up on the window though? You bet. I'm sure somebody's like found some kind of speed run technique this way. The famous licensed game stand on everything collision. Oh yep, we're scaling the building. Not not really supposed to scale the building, but we can do it. This isn't solid though. <laughs> Gotta love that. Ah uh, yeah, the nauseating camera. Well, well, it's not nauseating until you want to look up or down. Okay, so this game is based- this part's basically trying to tell you, oh hey, you got analog control, use it. It's like the- the sleeping piranha plant, basically. Not really worth it. So let's just move on from that. Dang man, I know the controls in Battle for Bikini Bottom DS are so horrible. I mean, I know there was a Game Boy port in all seriousness, but that was 2D, so... Well, then you can't really call it a port, I suppose. <laughs> I'll take it. I gotta say, Bubba Buddy, for a bubble, you really get around. SpongeBob, the robots are plundering Rock Bottom's museum, but they've broken the roadway leading up there. You'll have to be clever and find another route to get in. What if I lick all these stamps and mail myself? Could work, but perhaps being sneaky would be faster. <laughs> um, I think to unlock Mr. Krabs, you gotta jump into the pit in the Hazy Maze Cave about like 33 times, and then the white door will turn into a red door, and then you can walk in and be Mr. Krabs. I'm, tr I'm trying to see if I can cheese this. It's just too much fun to. Hmm. It seems like it's just barely not possible. I mean, it's probably possible if you use glitches and are a speedrunner. But I, I'm not doing either of those things. Oh yeah, this one... This one, he actually reflects. Time for a little sleepy snake. Yeah, so he actually reflects the bubbles, so you can't use it with that guy. Worked on the other guy, but not that guy. I don't actually know if that's solid there. Either way, we're going to want to activate that. Oh, and there's another one right over here. That guy. I don't like that guy. I don't gotta be sandy. We get an attack later that makes dealing with that guy a lot easier, though. So, okay, let's look around here. Oh yeah, that's right. You kind of have to open up a path for Sandy here. 
You gotta be SpongeBob and open up a path for Sandy. And this weirdo over here, gotta love him. Alright. Enemy spawns. That was a good idea. I'm glad I had that idea. I wonder how much cheese is possible here. Well, I just skipped that. Probably not a lot of a skip though, is it? Oh. Yeah, there's a bit of a speed challenge here. Thing is, I think I just cheated one section of it. Oh, but I do, I do still want to go over here. So that I can get this. Oh, that's not solid. You know, honestly though, I think a re-release of this game could work out. I mean, I think, I was thinking about this the other day. I think a lot of, uh, a lot of the problem with some of these licensed games is that they kind of treat them on the same level as like what every other piece of merchandise they create for it like you know if they make a lunchbox or like oh you know get a lunchbox you know get the poster and you know throw throw a video game out there you know they don't they don't really think about what goes into it which you know isn't too much of a problem when the game sucks but in an instance like this when it's actually pretty good um, the issue is I don't think they realize the the kind of uh, money they could potentially money 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 but uh, they could potentially make money off of a re-release re but I don't think that really occurs to them this is like downright some metal gear level music in this level Okay, all right, but we haven't completely created the path for Sandy yet, so we're gonna have to go back down. Hmm. Yeah, that's true. DuckTales did, in fact, do it, but to be fair, they had about, like, what, 20 years of hindsight? Okay, so that platform will take us up here now. So, we need the... Yeah, there's one over here. But yeah, I wouldn't mind seeing like an HD version of this game. I mean, granted, I feel like as far as what this game's going for, you probably don't need too much upgrading. But I don't know. I feel like they could probably, you know, get maybe get a better SpongeBob model in there. I also wouldn't mind seeing a re-release of uh, Toy Story 2, but I, well, I mean, I guess a re-release has happened, but a remake is a different story. Uh, I don't know where this guy came from. I'm in a bad position here. Oh. Well, gee whiz. Um. Now, if you want to see a cartoon that really does not translate well from 2D, 
take a look at Phineas and Ferb. Like, Phineas... Phineas was never meant to be... I'm pretty sure you could sequence break like that. Phineas was never meant to be viewed from the front. You know what, actually I'm gonna abuse the cheese factor. Since most of like the enemies seem to have respawned. Okay, there's an underwear up here. Okay, let's see how far we can get with Sandy here. Now what button? Oh uh, yeah, X. It's actually been a, a little bit since I played it. Not too long, like not Mega March Monday long, but still long enough for me to kind of forget the button layout. What's that? What's over there? Oh, I think I, I think I went to that building, right? Right? Yeah, I think so. Oh, well, I mean, it's not like we won't be able to come back, so... All right. Someone better make good use of all these. So we made it to the museum. Enter it from the top. Say, warn me if that sponge kid comes back again, okay? Alright, so we gotta be Spongebob for this. I wasn't sure, so... Oh, this enemy. The game's not very picky about where you are in relation to that. Barnacle boy! Are you on patrol down here? No, this is my second job. I, I work security. Now listen, if you want to reach Golden Spatula, you need to shut off the museum's security system. I think so. Though so maybe indirectly. You know, because she was Miss Appear. Pants or are they wrinkle free? Hey, hey, this is serious stuff. Now, if we don't get this robot thing resolved, Shady Shoals will shut down and I'll have to move back in with my son and his wife and his four screaming kids. Now, you see that vent on the other side of the museum? So, is this canon? Does Barnacle Boy have a son and four grandchildren? Yes, sir. That's where you exit the museum. Good luck, kid. I won't let you down, Barnacle Boy. All right, so now we're really getting some metal gear. Colonel, I'm in the Rock Bottom Museum. Good job, Snake. Now you just have to find Patrick's sock. On it. That was a tight window there. I didn't much care for that. Ow. Ow. 
And that's what happens if you don't dodge it. Pushing a simple button is the most satisfying. Push, 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 push. All right, we have deactivated the lasers, but robots have spawned. And this is actually from an episode, which is kind of incredible. I think a lot of the yeah, a lot of these are like like when SpongeBob does the painting close-ups. It's like this is a collection of those, I think. Thing I wish I could, you know, look up without getting vertigo. A cowboy hat, a lot of, a lot of cowboy stuff going on. there's that now I think this one might just be concept art and that's just a bowl of fruit yeah like see that there that's actually concept art for jellyfish fields I think for like the level in the game so interesting how they did that I keep trying. You can't blame a guy for trying. Oh, Hans! He is your lollipop. Can I grab that through here? Doesn't look like it. And yeah, that's concept art for another level that we haven't gone to yet. Oh. But it should, I think it should be the next one after this, so. So be ready for it. Oh. Uh. I mean, can we just talk for a minute about how legitimately cool the music in this game is? I mean, would you think that this song is from a SpongeBob game? It, like I was joking, but it legitimately does sound like something from Metal Gear. I mean, granted, from my limited knowledge of Metal Gear. On that note, I should probably play Metal Gear one day. Alright, so we have we have deactivated the lasers. I mean I know it's kinda of juvenile, but I really do love the, the fart sound effects when you kill the enemies here. It, for this, it kind of fits. All right. Well, I goofed that up. Like, how fast can I go without going out of my, uh, tiptoe state? That's the big question. <laughs> oh man. I mean, I guess that makes sense, but still. Uh, yeah. I mean, I, I, I don't blame you. The little, little freezes can be concerning, especially considering my history. Like, Lord, when I play Castlevania again, I'm going to save states constantly. I mean, hopefully I won't have to use them, but I'll be saving them regardless.
All right. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, oh yes, thank you. Okay, so do those fall eventually or what? Oh, he's talking about that guy. Oh, oh. Well, I gotta go to the box now. Yeah, if you if you time it right, you can just jump off of those, I think. Barbecue cubes and peak time pack. Uh, oh, uh. Okay, that time I made it. Ah, uh, yes. Money, 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 money. And here's a plaque. We will never deny a guest, even the most ridiculous request. Alright, there's a, a sock over there, and I'm gonna want that. If I can figure out how to get to it without losing everything I've ever held dear. Oh. And that is precisely how you don't do it. This has been a... This has been a demonstration on how not to play video games. Like I said, I can't really deal with those guys right now, but uh, later on we'll get a move that'll allow it. Okay, that I can... Oh, I should probably wait for that. So I'm wasting everybody's collective time, but there are two socks that you can get in here. That is pretty wonderful. If I could just like kind of cheat my way up here, that would be great. Oh, that would be great. I'm just wasting everybody's time. Okay, that was a bit of a glitch. Like, we just need to do a, a compilation of glitches that I've seen during this game. Because the glitches in this game are pretty interesting. No, 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 no. I said Yuji Naka eats socks, not that they were his socks, exactly. I mean, they could be, but that was never explicitly stated. It may not be canon. Okay, now I don't know about that one over there by the bowl of fruit, but I know that one would probably be easier to get once I'm on the other side. Maybe, actually, what might be the better idea is to come back in here is Sandy. Because she's got the hover. It shines. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to come back here. Oh, yeah, so, and they even give Sandy a shortcut. So, yeah, that's, that's what I'm going to do. Pulled it off. Congratulations, kid. Now, if I could only find my dentures. 
All right, so you come Sandy, get the missing socks. Sounds good. Not a sentence you would really say outside of this game. The problem is that guy just has enormous range and he causes, if you'll pardon the pun, splash damage. So, yeah, that, that guy is a candidate for probably the most annoying enemy in the game. Alright, so... I take it you still have to get up to, like, the top level in order to make that work, though. I think Sandy can just lasso these guys, can't she? I'm not sure. I don't know if Sandy can sneak quite like Spongebob can. Alright, so... Up here, Sandy's got, you know, the hover, the double jump. Well, I mean, I guess they all got the double jump, so that doesn't mean a whole lot. So no, like, let's see here. Okay, so you gotta kind of be over at that. Getting a lot of shiny objects this way, though, so that is very welcome. Okay. Yeah, this is this is clearly the way you're meant to do this. All right, go right through the ceiling. Okay, now just to get the other one, and we can move on. Blind squirt! The Trench of Advanced Darkness. I always love the name of that area. And it's a slide. Which is always a very fun part of any video game. Alright, uh, that's, that's dangerous. Okay, so no. Only SpongeBob can make that work. Sandy has to hey, that's a good idea, Gary. I'll try that. Okay, so you wanna be SpongeBob. Sandy's just for sock collection. Hey Gary, you're on an awful long walk, aren't you? Of advanced darkness, huh? Sounds dark. Okay, Gary, I'll be extra, extra, extra careful. <laughs> oh, man. Me doing platforming on things that they clearly don't mean for me to do platforming on. There's art up there, so I'm gonna want to get it. Thing is, Sandy jumps higher than Sponge. Sandy jumps higher than SpongeBob, so she can kind of make it up there. But SpongeBob himself, not quite as good. I mean, you can kind of get up there like that, but, you know, that ends up with you being massively dead. Okay, thank you. That's awfully convenient.
I mean, this is an area I may have to kind of look around for a while. There's a, looks like there's a lot of stuff here. <laughs> I'll, I'll take it. Okay, there's some stuff for Sandy. Got a lasso over there, Sandy, I guess. Yeah, there's a lot. This is a fairly dense area. Another bungee mission. Oh. I kind of gravitated towards that. It's for a sock, mostly. I guess you could get stuck on the corner there. I want that. I want it. Okay, I got it. Let's see what what happens if I get stuck on the stuck on the ledge. I want to find out. Oh, it's actually kind of hard to do that. I had it before, but it's not so easy to just do on demand, I guess. I have perished. I've got my eye on yours, Plankton. SpongeBob, I command you to bring Sandy to me for this next job. Plankton, you best not be stirring up no trouble. Nonsense. I only want to help. Help crush you all under my rise to power. What was that? Nothing. Say, see those lasers there? You mean them things that look like fancy washing machines? To your puny brain, I suppose. You'll need to turn on each one of those in order to cross the last part of the trench of advanced darkness. This better not be some kind of trick, permit. All right, but first we have more more uh, pressing matters to deal with. Ah, so that's how you do it. That makes sense. I guess. Alright, now there's that over there. I kind of want that. Then again, I guess maybe you're supposed to do the rest of the mission. Um, I don't guess you really need to. What's that for? Oh, no, I guess you're really just supposed to do that. Lasers are fun and good for you. Alright, so let's do it, I guess. Oh, that guy's back. Is not good for me. There's a sock down there, I'm noticing.
Oh my god! Well, all right, I guess that worked out. Oh, my leg. Oh, my leg. Uh, that building is upside down. Okay, bye. Alright, there's just some art hanging out right here, I guess. So yeah, I guess that's all the art. Take it back to Mrs. Puff, who definitely does not have any sinister motive. I might as well be playing Castlevania. We got it. Can I go over here on this? Yes and no. Yeah, I think it was that. What am I missing here? Oh, I'm actually missing a few. I have not received this task. Entirely sure offhand what those are. Oh. <sighs> there we go. All right, sounds good to me.
It is entirely possible they wanted me to be SpongeBob for this. It is also entirely possible that I don't care. Yeah, not sure about those other two I'm missing. Oh, there's a slide. That could be it. Ahoy there, Sandy. Top of the morning to you, Mr. Krabs. Hey, Mr. Krabs, what are you doing? Well, I could have sworn me I saw a golden spatula here a minute ago, but I think it fell down this slide. Down the slide? It might have broken its leg. I've got to save it. Go, boy, go! Save that poor spatula! All right, well, that's one of them accounted for. I want the shiny object. Is that so much to ask, really? Alright, so I think I'm just missing one besides the one Miss, Mrs. Puff's gonna give me. Oh god, no. Alright, so yeah. But I should be able to warp back here if I think it's over here. So, I mean, the, the fast travel system in this game is... Well, it's very welcome, let's say that much. You could totally just jump under the slide from here if you wanted to. It shines! Well, that's frustrating a little bit. trying to sabotage me but it did not work oh there's a sock up there oh and there's one over here too and also a thing for sandy So, I mean, I guess that brings you up here. And which you can get a sock this way. Hmm. That, that last one's a mystery, though.
And well, this does kind of leave me in a bit of a, a bind. Bit of a, a bit of a position, if you, if you can call it that. And I'm missing one sock. So yeah. A bit of MIA items here. Uh, so... I don't know. I might have to check a guide for that one. Last piece of artwork accounted for, Mrs. Puff. I left no strange glowing stone unturned. Well now, nice work, SpongeBob. The museum will finally be able to reopen. And here's your reward. I mean, I, I figure I could probably call it there. Like, as far as rock bottom goes. I'll have to probably look up this one. But I gotta be right back. I'm I'm back. Don't worry. Out. Sh snarf. All right. So the next one is the one I think it is. Yeah, Sand Mountain. This is an interesting level. Creatures go to enjoy an afternoon of falling down. Squidward, am I glad you're here. I need to borrow your toothbrush again. What? You've used it before? Oh, yeah, lots of times. I figured if you didn't know, you wouldn't mind. Fine. What do I care? I'm a wreck anyways. I try and get some exercise to relax from all this robot mess, and now everything's ruined. Because of a toothbrush? No, it's those blasted robots! They've taken over the ski slopes! How can I ski with those ugly things beating everyone up? 
Listen, SpongeBob, you've got to help me. I'm going to lose my marbles if I don't get some relaxation. I've found if you keep your marbles in a bag, they don't get lost as often. In fact, I've got mine right here. It's embroidered with this lovely... Forget the marbles! I've got a better idea. If you get rid of the robots at the bottom of every slope for me, I'll give you one of those golden spatulas. Well, I don't know. It's hard to beat the extreme fun of marbles. Okay, okay, I'll give you one for each slope you clear. Now that's a deal. All right. And that's a suck. So yeah, we're at the Bikini Bottom Ski Slopes now. With the worst guy. You know, I'm half tempted to just beat the next boss so I can get the item to deal with him. I don't know if that's how you're supposed to do that, but I was very clearly not. But it can be done. Hello, my most favorite friend in the whole world. I found another golden spatula for you. Oh boy! Can I have it? Sure, if you fall down to the bottom of this pit. Isn't there a safer way? It's always safety with you people. Hmm. I suppose you could bungee down. And it is basically pay some money for a golden spatula. I thought, you know, Mr. Krabs already had that covered, but. Also, yeah, this place kind of just has the Bikini Bottom music, but I also don't entirely mind because the Bikini Bottom music's pretty good. Oh, this is a Sandy. This is a Sandy. So yeah, there's this little main area, but... Yeah, it's mostly, like, there's there's this little uh, area at the start here, but this is mostly a level purely about sliding. So you're gonna, I'm gonna go down the three slopes. You know, Squidward's gonna reward us handsomely. You know where he's getting them from, I don't know. But there's nothing a land critter can't handle. Ow. Oh, but you gotta pay. Oh and I don't I don't have enough. So I gotta I gotta grind a few. How many are in this level? Ten. Wow. That's a lot. Alright, just about five more. No, yeah, five more. Alright, so. If nothing else, we can grind some more on the actual slope here. Yeah, we're gonna need all the ones we can get. Probably gonna wanna be SpongeBob. There's nothing like that smell of 
bubbles in the morning. Smells like. Smells like what? I've gone down I'm this hill a hundred times, usually rolling. Darn kids think it's funny to push me, but if you can beat my time down the hill, I'll give you a golden spatula. I'm not sure if this is the music that's supposed to be playing. I won't knock it though, it's good music. Oh, no. Because there's the music that's supposed to be playing. And there's definitely some socks on this slope. That much I am certain of. Now where? That's a different story. There's probably one up there, come to think of it. Alright, now we're just gonna clear this out. I'll probably go down this slope a couple of times, but you know, we need the we need the shiny object to go on the other ones anyway. Mostly because I want those socks. Maybe I'll go down it as Sandy this time. If she's got the hover, it'd probably make it a little bit easier to like go specifically for what I'm trying to get. So we're almost to 1,500 again, so. Congratulations! You passed with flying colors! So, I guess maybe I'll go down it once and stick to all the right pass, and then maybe once with the left. I don't know, I take, I take, I take that kind of thing seriously. Gotta keep a sharp eye out. Oh, I guess that counts as the right path, wouldn't it? Well, it's not the one I took the last time, at least. I don't, I don't know. Okay, right about here. Yep. Oh, but you st you stop sliding here. <laughs> that's that's kind of funny. Or a thin. So I'm guessing the music just kind of keeps going. And what the heck, I'll go down one more time and take the all the left paths and then we'll move on to the next slope. Like I said, we need the shining objects anyway. Um, what? Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, just a, just a darn second here. What was it letting me lasso? Is it the signs? Oh, 
Oh, but you can probably get on top of that. Well, not like that you don't, but it's just a shiny object up there. You probably gotta preserve your momentum going off of it and try to like wait till the last second. Can I get on top of that? I would appreciate being able to get on top of that. Eh, I, I don't appreciate it that much. Left path. Oh, yep, there's a sock. So I'm glad I did it. I'm not really used to the fact that if you do the lasso, it, it stops, like, all your momentum. Like, you come to a, gr a grinding halt. You stop on a dime. And see, now the music actually stopped correctly. I wonder if they ever intended to give this place like its own music or if they were from the start just gonna be like, oh, just use the Bikini Bottom music. Anyway, slope one dealt with, now for slope two. Flounder Hill. Oh, there's like eight snowmen on this one. Hey there, Sandy. Howdy, bubble buddy. You're gonna want to be the sponge. I fly like the wind and float like a sea bee. If you can beat my time down the hill, I'll give you a golden spatula. Okay. So I'm gonna stick to all the right paths, probably. Oh, well, no, this is clearly a hint. Yeah, this is another one I'm probably gonna have to do a few times, if only for the snowman challenge. Uh, let's go with the right path. such wanton destruction to snowmen. All right, all you invertebrates. man down there. There's a sock up here. Oh man, beat that one by a hair. I will say that out of all the levels, this is the one that kind of feels a little bit like padding, but... It's still fun, so I'll, you know, I'll, I'll allow it. Oh. Is 
satisfying. Push, 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 push. Hopefully the game's not too loud. I realize it's kind of late to ask that, but it, you know, it seemed all right. I mean, I'm gonna assume if no one says anything that it's probably fine, but it's hard to say for sure, pardon me. Congratulations, SpongeBob, you beat my bet. All right, but we still gotta do the snowman challenge. And I think we, yeah, we still need a bunch of shiny objects in order to do the uh, next proper slope. Okay, this time I'm gonna hold a hard left. There's a lot of branching paths on this one. So this one might take a couple run-throughs. Probably be going for these tinkies, all things considered. All right, found one of them. Oh man, I would I'd play this on Mario Kart Wii. You know I would too. Maybe you could make it like that Wario Mountain stage and make it to where each uh, each course is its own lap. They're gonna take the hard left. I know there's a snowman there, but I'm gonna get it. Well, if I don't die. I can't remember what there was over this way. I assume I took the top path last time, so this this time let's take the bottom one here. Well, you know. As long as these heads are square and this sponge is Bob, I will not let the king bottom down. Oh, uh, that's taken directly from an episode. How about that? Oh, but if I die, I... Oh, that is rude. That is... That is... So is this. Oh, my leg. Alright, so the snowman challenge has to be done in one life. Good to know. That is frustrating, but, you know, I guess it's what must be done. If only there was a way to, like, prick quick restart the course.
like just when you get to the bottom immediately restart Oh, that was not a good thing for me to do. gonna stick to the middle path this time. Well, let's let's do this. Get this thing done. I mean we only have two more golden spatulas in this stage and I'm pretty sure I know what they are. You know, I could probably, I should probably be Sandy for this. She should, blah, 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 blah. she has very slightly different sliding physics, I think. Uh, geez, yeah. No, that's not... This is not going good. I would prefer not to die if I could help it. Oh, okay. Accidentally stopped all momentum there. This is going to take a little bit. Oh god, I didn't even do it that time. I just kind of snagged on a hitbox of some kind. Oh, but there's an underwear. Hup, hup. I don't like it. I very much do not like it. Yeah, better take a heel down here. Yeah, I know, I know the feeling, chat. I don't get a lot to say about this either. Oh, well, that, that was poor on my end. Okay, I guess taking the hard right path. I gotta remember that I can like halt all momentum at a moment's notice. When I'm Sandy. Gonna find those last few snowmen.
or Sandman, I guess one could say. Turning up empty. Check the right here. Wait, was this the right or the left? I mean, I guess using Sandy, we could check this area out pretty thoroughly. Might be a bit tedious, but I mean, maybe not as tedious as like just doing the whole slide over and over. I mean, is it? That would be up to you. Probably check the very top path there. Good times. Doesn't help, it's still a bit warm in this house. Oh, I don't I don't think I can. I think this that's the one spot where I absolutely got or maybe maybe I can make that. Oh, I got my arms itchy. Ah, ah. Yeah, I don't I don't think I don't think it's happening. Yeah, that's that's not happening from this angle. Oh. Jeez. This is, this is gonna be the majority of the stream and you know it. Oh, there's one right there and I somehow never saw it. Wait, is that, is that one up there? No, I think, I don't think so. I think I already got that. I mean, was there anything else to this one, this path? I mean, I don't know, it's getting hard to keep track of where I have and have not been. Oh yeah, well, okay, I've been here. Oh man, with all their uh, references to the actual show, they should have had a billboard for Kevin's ointment here. Kevin's favorite.
All right, so let's try the top half this time at the very, very top half. They are most definitely not delicious. Oh, that's not good. Okay, so very, very top path is turning up empty. So that last snowman, I'm kind of starting to be at a loss for that one. Oh man, we are... Uh... Wait, was that a was that a Texas thing up there, or am I just going crazy? I I think it's possible I'm just going crazy. Okay, I went left here last time. Let's go right. We gotta narrow it down somehow. But I'm pretty sure I've already gotten it here too. So where on earth could this last one be? If you, if you can think of any paths I haven't taken yet, I'm going to be glad to hear them. Oh, that last one sticks around a while. Am I missing something over here? Doubt it. Cause I got like every one except for one of them. I don't want to just kind of leave and waste that. But at the same time, I'm starting to get very confused. already got the one down here and I am very close to being out of health which is not good all right how about this I'm gonna give it uh, one more go I'm gonna try going middle path every time and then taking left when there's not a middle path This is, this is gonna be like probably last try I, if I can't find it I might just like look for it uh, off stream That was nearly the worst thing I've ever done in my life. I wonder, am I finally having a screaming at your, your uh, monitor moment?
Or wait, do I have to... Wait a minute, do I have to go back to the lobby? I have to go back to the lobby and destroy that one, don't I? I swear to God, if that's it... I'm gonna bet you like a million bucks that was what it was. Either way, I'm at a loss here. So nonetheless, I'm leaving. No, that one's already destroyed out here. Maybe there's another one somewhere else? I mean, I don't know. They all seem to be mostly contained on that one. I'm, I'm just, I'm at a loss. I, I got nothing. Let's, uh, let's do the last one. SpongeBob and Pot the Larry. I'm built for speed with this aerodynamic physique, but I'll give you a golden spatula if you can beat my time. All right, going all left. Unless I, you know, find all the socks, in which case, who cares anymore? Oh, this is unsafe. Okay, I said all left and I'm sticking to it. I think that loud noise is actually disrupting my video signal. You can kind of tell when those things are going to hit. They kind of have a digital hood flag. a long and yeah it's kind of starting to get a little complicated uh, didn't manage to beat uh, Larry's time up oh.
Nope. Nope. and fairly soon. Feel like a new sponge. Had to try to beat Larry's time again. This time I'll take all the right paths. See if we can find, I mean, there's like, I don't know, there's like three socks missing in this level, which is not a good, not a good feeling. I'm the fastest there is. My time to... So, yeah, this this might end up having to be a level that I kind of come back to off off stream and like clean up a little bit. Okay, there's there's gonna be something up there for Sandy. Oh, there's a sock up there. So yeah, right path to Sandy. It's gonna be a good idea. Uh, did I miss a sock there? I honestly have no idea. Again, might be worth checking out as Sandy. But right now we got a time challenge to do. Probably shave off a fair amount of time by like jumping over to this path. Taking a risk. Risk paid off. Risk did not pay off. Wait, did I win? Did I, did I win? Did that count as me winning? I'm built for spirit. Okay, now, so we're gonna, we're gonna check this out, but first let's just, let's just beat the time. Let's just do that first. Like, with the, I fell off. Yeah, just the focus here, beating the time. That's all that's all we're doing. And then we'll check out a little bit of the other stuff is Sandy. And then I'll probably end the stream. I mean I could do the I could do the part boss. Oh geez, those poor people. I could do the industrial part boss, but you know, I don't think I'll end up doing it this time. 
I'll probably like start off the next one with it. Yeah, like that legitimately disrupts my video signal. Maybe that's the shortcut. I don't know if there's a sock in there or what. Sure is good for time though. Check out that one spot is Sandy. Yeah, still missing uh, quite a few socks. But like I said, I don't know, I might have to just search for it on my own time because I feel like if I spend too long just looking for socks, it's going to get tedious. didn't pick up but just just in the off chance that it did does that keep going without me I don't know I mean, I could probably go back up and press the switch again and disrupt my video signal a little bit more. I might just need a new video cable for my GameCube. Possible. Or maybe it's the splitter what's doing this. That thing has a very lenient hitbox. Okay, this time I'm not gonna jump off. I knew it. But so I'm missing exactly one sock on this level. But I'm all good as far as golden spatulas go. How about this? I'll give it one more go, and then uh, I'll end the stream. That was not good, almost. Can just stand on this for a while.
Wasn't there a thing to the right, like, I could have jumped off or something at one point? Well, I don't know. I don't know. I want to test the theory, though. Hmm. I don't know why sometimes the uh, music works and sometimes it doesn't. Either way, I guess that's probably it for the stream. Ah. Oh, my bones. My bones.